10 and 0. Bit of practice in the game. So hopefully we won't get a lazy man playing Fianchetto, pawn pushing. Let's get a game of chess going. Mm, that's fresh. That's very fresh. I'm inclined to bring here attacking the queen. And then take. And then take. And then take. And last but not least, check on the king. And oh, might have done that slightly wrong, you know. <laughs> yeah, I think I did that slightly wrong, but it's okay. It's no problem. They can have a pawn up. Oh, they're not doing the pawn up. Let's take. Is that a missed opportunity? I think that was a missed opportunity, wasn't it? I don't really want to have split pawn. Isolated pawn here, so I'm gonna bring that up. I think we might have got a bit lucky there, or are they steaming in? They look like they're steaming in. Let's attack their knight, attack something, give them something to think about, give me a bit of tempo to maybe get castled. Yeah, I think we'll go on castle. Looking at steamrolling this square. So it's white squared bishop. Push the pawn up. And let's push on to the bishop so we can get the knight out. Can't really bring it here. Could have taken the knight off the ball, but maybe we keep that just there for now. Shall we attack? Let's get the knight out. Let's not be too hasty. He landed on anything, it's attacking the pawn here. Can push the pawn up. If he comes for this one, then we take with the knight. Sound like a plan? Yeah, let's push. Hoping late development of this is going to, but I think the knight's going to be coming out now, isn't it? And it's, he's owning the file, so we want to put pressure. Oh, he's coming for the bishop as well. Mm, and he's also stopping the knight from moving. Oh, we feel a bit congested in, really, don't we? Because we can't really... We can hit the rook here, seeing as the knight's not developed. And we can take... And we've got space for the bishop to move and attack the bishop if it gets attacked. It's not doing that, though. So we could attack the bishop. If we attack the bishop, the rook comes here and it's pinning through to our king. So shall we just move the king across or do we move the knight first? Can't really move the knight here. No space for the knight to move. Wow. Wow, so our knight is just completely jammed in in the corner. If we brought the rook up here, then at least the knight can come here to get into the game. So I'm going to bring the knight into the game. If it don't get taken, we attack the bishop. I'm going to take. I'm going to attack. Goes to defend, we can take, I think, but then his rook comes there and we'll get pinned again. Yeah. Bishop there. Oh, the rook goes there. So the rook's gone there. So do we just take... So it's a bishop against a knight. Interesting times. He might win these pawns, might he? Mm, boom. He's got my knight. Hold on. Yeah, so if we go here, then he goes here. I can't push that. So 
So can I go for some of a pawn a pawn of his? Interesting. I can't defend it, can I? I can't get a pawn of his. One two, one. He takes. No, that's not good, is it? One, not hitting anything. No, oh, that's the half decent strike, isn't it? Knight comes here to defend, but then he just goes here, hits me. Hmm, hmm, <laughs> up. Why can't I get any of his pawns with my knife? This is really weird. Tuck this pawn. It just moves. Tuck this pawn. He's going to get two pawns though, isn't he? I'm not going to get any. Because he'll take that, then I'll move. And then he just move this down. Or wherever. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not getting the pawns. Crack, he's moved it. He moved it. I think he's lost tempo, hasn't he? The bishop's not getting this now. Oh, after all that thinking. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Is there a fork? Just get the king up. Lots of thinking there, and... Uh, Come on, there must be a fork. Mm, not going to get away with this, am I? It's not happening, he's going for a draw. Very tricky. We're actually plus one. <laughs> oh, crikey. Plus one, but I feel the knight just can't get to the pawns. Oh no, that's gonna hurt. We take, he comes here, and then he's got he's got that pawn because we've come and defend here, then he just come and take that pawn off the board. Our king's defending here. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work, is it? So I think we need to just move the knight around to uns unsettle them a bit maybe and see if we can get either this center pawn or the other pawn off the board gotta get a right position though what? Um, it looks really odd trying to get these pawns. here attack this one he drops obviously we take but the bishop is there so we can't take so then we're trying to get around this attacking this one the king's still there attacking this one right okay so now we have a pawn because we have a fork Oof.
don't want to trap the knight though with his funky bishop. So we're not getting this one now. So we can come back here for protection. Or do we is there a way of getting across there? That doesn't look good that pattern. I think this one Let's get the check on. Don't trap your knight, please. Okay, right. Oh, he's coming around the back, dude. Ah. Oh. He's coming around the back. King can drop here. Whilst the knight's doing a dance. Can't get this pawn because the bishop's there. Up oh, and up. Oh, no, the bishop's there. I can't do that. Damn. Let's go here. Here. Let's bring the king. Attack the bishop. Get to these pawns. Bishop needs to move. <clears throat> um, we could take the bishop now, I think. But then it's just a draw. I mean, we've got these two linked pawns here. What does the king do? Go backwards and forwards. Uh, it's really wanting me to go for the draw. It's really wanting me to take the bishop off. I'm going to hold out a bit longer and see if there's something we can fashion. So now it's got that, we can just take and got the two linked pawns here. I just need to try and get these disheveled and maybe it's the power of these pawns moving up. That I need to work out. Okay, so we've got a check on the king and we've got the pawn. Another fork. Excellent. Right, don't trap it. It can come back here safe. So can we push or the bishop's just going to come here and jam it in anyway? Let's get the knight back around again and just sit it here. Don't want to lose on time, so let's just move a little bit swifter. So I'm glad at least the opponent's having, let's take this off the board, having to think as well, and they're struggling finding the better moves. And it's really quite hard, you know. Don't want to go into a white square, but I'm gonna, let's go into this. Let's go here. Right. Um, any forks yet? No, no, no. Shall we start pushing the pawns? Was that the right pawn? This pawn's protected by the knight, so the bishop's probably going to look to take the knight off the board. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I hate it when they've got like a bishop. Oh, we've got a fork. We've got a beautiful fork. Let's take this off the board. I'm tired of this game now. Let's go. <laughs> so get this off the board. Let's get some get the game over and done with this annoying annoying good player <laughs> let's go so he's definitely not getting a queen before us so we don't need to panic let's get the queen no more movement of that pawn no more 
let's just grab it there's no stalemate let's just hold him on the back okay so you could go arty and do all that but I might stalemate it Just go simple. Nice game.